Hello, and welcome to the State Library of Florida's tutorial on how to access free continuing education. If you are a nurse employed by the State of Florida, the State Library provides access to free continuing education opportunities that are fully accredited by the Florida Board of Nursing. This brief tutorial will show you how to access those continuing education modules using Nursing Reference Center Plus, an electronic database just for nurses employed by the state of Florida. It will also show you how to import your continuing education credits into CE Broker, the official continuing education tracking system for the Florida Department of Health. Go to info.florida.gov slash state hyphen employees. This will take you to the Services for State Employees page for the State Library. This is your home base when using the library. You will need a valid State Employee Library card to use Nursing Reference Center Plus and earn free continuing education credits. If you do not have a State Library card, you can apply for a card online by clicking Sign Up Online for a Library Card. Once you have your library card number and PIN, Return to the Services for State Employees page and select the Search Our Databases link in the center of the page. This will take you to the Electronic Databases portal. From here, scroll down to the link to Nursing Reference Center Plus. Click the link and log in with your library card number and PIN to access the database. This is the main screen for Nursing Reference Center Plus. Nursing Reference Center Plus is a very powerful database designed for a clinical setting. You can search for diseases, find drug information, and create customized patient education sheets in English and Spanish. This tutorial focuses strictly on continuing education. To start, click the Continuing Ed tab near the top of the screen, and then click on Take a Continuing Education Course. Next, choose a module you want to start with. You can either browse the list or search by topic in the search box. Today, we will use AIDS as an example. Type it into the box and then click search. At the first result, click on CE module to go to the module. Clicking on the link brings us to the CE login screen. CINAHL is the service that offers these modules, which is why we see their name at the top. You need to have an account to keep track of your CE. We will log in in just a moment but first let's see how to create an account. Click on the link to pre-register. This takes us to a registration screen. Please make sure you use your work address when you sign up. If not, the system will not be able to export your credits to CE Broker. Once you fill out the form, CINAHL will send you an email to activate your account. I'll go back and log in with my demo account now. Next, pick the option Nursing Reference Center Plus. You may need to search again to get to the right module. Once you are there, agree to the terms to start the module. Now we are inside the CE module for AIDS. You'll see important information in the middle, and you can navigate different parts of the module using the gray tabs at the top of the screen. When you start a module, it will give you pre-study information. This includes how long the module will take, how to pass the module, and how much credit you will get. Click on the bottom link to continue to the course materials. The course materials are the heart of the module. You'll see the goal, learning objectives, and an abstract at the top. As you read through the module, you will learn more about the content. In this case, the module covers the etiology, treatment options, and other information for AIDS. You'll also see links to other materials in the main text, such as care sheets from Nursing Reference Center Plus. Finally, you can click on the links in the references if you want to review more. These links will only work if you are logged in, so make sure you always log in that way. Now, let's scroll back to the top and click on the gray box that says Interactive Review. The interactive review is a set of eight questions. It's a quiz you can take before taking the module's final exam, and there are no limits to how many times you can take it. Lastly, we will take a look at the final exam. This page will tell you about the conditions for the exam. Make sure you are completely ready to take the test. 
If you fail or don't finish, you can't take it again for another 90 days. Before you start any modules, follow these next steps if you want to enable automatic reporting to CE Broker. Click on Profile in the top right. Under Personal and Professional Information, enter your license number beginning with RN. This will let CINAHL talk to CE Broker. So, now you know how to get free continuing education credits through the State Library of Florida. If you have any questions, please contact the library at info at dos.myflorida.com or 850-245-6682. And be sure to check out our YouTube channel for more tutorials. Thanks for watching.